Sara, welcome to Scania stand at IAA. Could you tell something about who you are? Thank you so much. Uh, I'm super excited to be here today with Scania. My name is, as you said, Sarah Elfson. I'm responsible for sales and business development at Northvolt. We're so excited about the progress that you're making. You're an extremely important supplier to us, and you will provide us with much of the battery cell that we will need you in this decade. You're more than a supplier. We're working in a partnership, not only with the current battery technology, but also the future battery technology. So, great uh, partnership moving forward. How are you looking at our partnership today? So, uh, Skolnia, as you said, early investor, really important technology leader within this uh, field. Uh, they are also our first customers in, uh, within the automotive business that going live with SOP in next year. This has also enabled us to um, to get a lot of support within the in industrialization, which we are always very thankful about. I also have to highlight that we also have a tight relationship in our collaboration, and we worked on on different uh, modules and, uh, and looking at what our common technology on batteries and the EV trucks can enable. And we can see that this is indicating really great results, which we are super happy about, about the global warming potential it has. 50% reduction with uh, uh, average of uh, 2020 energy level. And if we could uh, move that into fossil free, it could reach 90 and you said even 20, uh, 95, right? That's really great uh, uh, achievement from the both companies. Scania has also enabled us to reach a better also CO2 footprint. And one of those areas are that we are using your trucks between our gigasite in, in Kaleftio uh, from the harbor to the, to the factory. And this is uh, helping us uh, achieving our very ambitious goals. We are going through a radical transformation and we will move from conventional ICE technology to battery electric technology. This is of course great for our decarbonization targets. During a lifetime of a vehicle, a battery electric vehicle running on renewable electricity emits 95% less than an ICE vehicle running on diesel. But what's happening is interesting that we're moving the CO2 from the user phase to that supply chain. And most notable, the CO2 in the BEVs will come from the battery. That's why it's so important for Scania to only source green batteries with renewable energy in all stages of the battery production. So I want to ask you, Sara, how important is it for Nordvolt to have customers that put clear sustainability demands on you? Oh, I think always uh, a really tough customers is also the best thing for a company uh, to develop, uh, to be really competitive on the global market. And I think uh, Scania has a, a very ambitious target, and so do we. Uh, today, the average is around 100 kilo uh, CO2 for one kilowatt hour. And, uh, and that level is way too high uh, for the market going forward. We are today, thanks to our uh, fossil free production energy in our first gigafactory, close between 40 to 30 uh, kilos, and our target uh, is set to 10. But with that, uh, we really need to get engaged with the circularity model and with the recyclable material to reach that level. But as a Northvolt, uh, as a company, is, is based on that from the beginning, it's a very part of our uh, setup. So I wanted to talk a little bit about closing the loop. So batteries will be the most valuable component in our vehicles. And the materials are not only expensive, but they are also increasingly scarce and will be difficult to access. And that's the reason of keeping them in circulation as long as possible. Another reason is sustainability. We just cannot continue as we have to take things from the ground, create products, and then generate waste. So, simply put, we need to make batteries circular. 
How are you in Northwood working with circularity today? Thanks for asking that as well. It, this is a, a key topic for us, and we can see it from different point of view. That you say, with the hockey stick curve we have, the, this is going to be a scared resource in the world. And both from the ground, but also on the recyclable part. We're trying right now also re already to collect uh, old cells, uh, uh, cells from recalls, to create now uh, a setup within our business unit that we call Revolt. And Revolt is working with different setups to, uh, to recycle this material. And that site is placed in the same area as our Giga site. And there will be a pipe coming from the recycle uh, uh, from the recyclable plant to the uh, upstream where we do the cathode. In that way, we'll also enable the whole process flow to go in a circular way. What our customers are very nervous about is the cost and the volatility within this market, price-wise as well. Not only on the sustainability, and with this circular model, we'll be able to some type hedge and control better the cost level we have on, on this area. Circularity is also important for the grounders in our, in our target to achieve uh, world leading status and the greenest battery in the world. And, but it's also on a holistic view. So we also have invested in sodium uh, uh, salt into fertilizing, which is also one way of looking at that on the higher level. We also have, uh, and I think we announced this as well, uh, invested in a former paper plant in Borlänge in Sweden, uh, where we're taking a paper mill into a gigasite. So I think from uh, Northvolt's view, we are, this is on our agenda every day, and we are looking at it on the opportunistic, but as well as uh, sustainable, but also uh, good for our customers, so they become competitive in their field. So it's a very important for us, absolutely. So thank you so much, Sara, for joining us here today. I think I can speak for all of Scania when I say that we're looking forward to our future cooperation. Thank you so much for uh, inviting us here today. We're so excited to be a partner to Scania, and we're also excited to get the, your trucks and our trucks and ourselves on the road and uh, be uh, successful going forward. Thank you.